place so that there wouldn't be any uh, problem because if you are going to detach or remove it and you don't do it or you don't follow the right procedure you are likely to destroy the seedling you are likely to plant it and it may not be able to continue to grow so all that you need to do is that you follow us in our next episode how to detach or separate the young seedlings from the mother so basically how to produce 500 suckers from one sucker we are still hello viewers it's smart agro innovation again today we are still on how to produce 500 suckers from one sucker using my method which involves a pre-nursery and a post-nursery now um previously we did this method of multiplication and this is an episode seven of it which is um the 21st week that is the third week we've given you the two weeks result and this is the 21 days result that we have so far we are still monitoring closely till 40 days before we uh, settle on it with our results now um if you look at this you see that two is on when you watch it you see the performance of our uh, seedlings coming up right now what we have here um after 21 days this is how the multiplication is this is the result we had here is two here is this two we still don't have any uh seedling emerging um, i think this one has been exposed this one no result yet and here too we still have one um here is still one this is one it's also coming up you can see that here there is one here also growing nicely and there is another one coming up so we have uh okay we have three of them imagine we have one two three yeah and here too we have three and still counting after 21 days here we still have one only one ceiling coming up we have two here um here too we have three one two three coming up there's another one here so it means that we have four over there here is one here is really wonderful we have one two three four rising here too we have three in fact we have all the accords over there and we surely do a comparison we have two so which of the height after the whole thing we shall compare the height and the diameter that give the highest number here we have two here we have one here two this one we are still up for going no result yet here only one here two we have two 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 we have another two we have one we have two here two we have two only one one and two one one we have two 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 one two then here we have one two there two we have two in that order here we have only one so we are still doing uh, comparison here we have two imagine so on the average now we are getting two i think the two the highest number is four and we have two 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 out we are still monitoring closely um if the number will 
keep increasing or maybe it is going to maintain it for now but one thing that we still want to do is that if you look at this side they are fully matured you can see this side too the two here to in that order so what you are going to do now is that if you look at this side they have about four leaves four leaves so uh, very soon you are going to detach this you are going to remove all this you are going to remove these seedlings from it and still leave it if there could be another sprouting because once you remove this the mother will be there and there wouldn't be any competition and um, it is possible that regeneration can take place once these ones are being removed still it will have the tendency of cell division occurring again to give us another number so we shall remove all these which has four leaves we remove them plant it cover it again and then we wait for higher number you see it's very interesting this particular side you see that we have four here we have three um two in that order so um as i said we are going to um remove it or detach it and that aspect is a bit technical and that will form part in our next video so that you look at how after getting your seedling like this how best you can detach your seedlings so that there wouldn't be any uh, problem because if you are going to detach or remove it and you don't do it or you don't follow the right procedure you are likely to destroy the seedling we are likely to plant it and it may not be able to continue to grow. So all that you need to do is that you follow us in our next episode. How to detach or separate the young seedlings from the mother. So basically how to produce 500 suckers from one sucker. We are still in the process of multiplication. I told you we need the number. So after removal of all this, surely the parent will surely give us another number. And we are up and going. So it's simple, straightforward, understandable, and, you know, very, 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 very interesting in doing multiplication. Thank you very much once again for watching us. This is Smart Agro Innovation, your channel that teaches much about agriculture in a very simple way we do not hide any procedure from you you make it simple for you to see that indeed this is how it is so this is the episode seven of how to put five hundred sucker from one sucker keep watching us kindly subscribe to our channel share to farmer friends so that you spread the knowledge across May the Almighty Lord bless you. My name is Anthony Beidu from Ghana, West Africa. Yeah, yeah.